Hello everyone, I am Dr. Dhanis Salim. We all know that the COVID-19 or the coronavirus directly affects a patient's or person's lung. This is the reason that serious COVID-19 positive patients have been requiring a constant oxygen supply to survive. In such a time of crisis, let us look at the some ways to better our lungs function. One such method is the use of an incentive spirometer. An incentive spirometer is a device used to help our lungs to recover after surgery or a lung illness. So we have to know more about how to use an incentive spirometer correctly. Spirometer is also used in the case of chronic obstructive pulmonary disease that is COPD. That is an inflammatory lung disease that blocks the airflow of the lung and makes it difficult to breathe. So it is very helpful for those patients. How to use the incentive spirometer? First, sit on the edge of your bed if possible or sit up as far as you can in a bed. Second, hold the incentive spirometer in an upright position. Third, place the mouthpiece in your mouth and seal your lips tightly around it. Breathe in slowly and as deeply as possible, notice the piston racing towards the top of the column. Hold your breath as long as possible, at least for 5 seconds. Then, exhale slowly and allow the piston to fall to the bottom of the column. Then you have to rest for a few seconds and repeat step 1 to 5 at least 10 times in a set. This we have to repeat 4 times in a day. Position the yellow indicator on the left side of the spirometer to show your best effort. Use the indicator as a goal to work towards during each slow deep breath how much you can improve. So after each set of 10 deep breaths. You can cough to be sure. You can cough so that your lungs will be clear. Then spit out. Okay. That is, if you have an incision in your abdomen or something, while you are coughing, you can use a uh, pillow or you can support it. So that's an another way to prevent hernia. This device you can use it four times in a day. Before food, three times, and just before sleep, one time. So four times, ten sets each. So that will expand your lungs and will push out the fluids which are there in the alveoli and alveoli will not be collapsed. It will be expanded and you will get more airflow into your lungs. Your lung capacity will increase. So share this information to everyone. Knowledge is important. Choose a better life. We will come with another good topic soon. Take care everyone.